understood you, you came here obviously because you thought you'd have some freedom as a freshman. Mm -hmm. They let you make some mistakes. So you, 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 I suppose you're happy about that, that, that you really got to get your feet wet. Yeah, you yeah, definitely. Too much. Yeah, definitely. You know, we dove right in. Um, I made a few mistakes. Uh, but overall, you know, it was really good. Hey, Kristen, you knew two weeks ago that you were going to be the starter? Uh, you have to ask Coach O'Brien that question. That's what he told us. When you found out, what were your thoughts? Were you surprised? What was your reaction? Um, you know, it's just hard work. Uh, you know, a lot of credit for the other guys on the team. Uh, they really helped me out through the whole process. What did you think you did well for them? Um, you know, I think that as a team, we did well executing. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things we got to improve on, and uh, we're going to continue to do that. And what would you like to improve on? Um, you know, just recognize the defenses and uh, continue from there. When you got a playmaker like Robinson in the game, Definitely, um, you know, he's a great player. Uh, made a lot of big plays for us today, uh, as well as Gino. You know, the whole receiving really stepped up today. Tonight as well. Bill showed some confidence in you in some tough situations. Even if you made a mistake here or there, what did it mean for the staff to have, you know, going for it on third and eleven kind of with seven minutes to go? To, to know they had that confidence in you. Yeah, you know, it's great to know that I have that confidence. It always helps uh, to know that the staff is behind you and what you can do, and uh, you know, to also have the team, you know, understand that. Go, did, did go over that play, the third and eleven, what you saw and what what happened on it. The third and eleven was that was picked off by the lineman, the defensive lineman. Oh, the that, defensive that lineman. Back. Yeah. Uh, you know, he just jacked out. Um, we knew that the World League safety. Uh, we had practiced it, but um, you know that was that was a mistake I made. Christian, though, what is this like for you? Four months ago, you're playing high school baseball. Now you're playing in a pro stadium and and talking to all the reporters. What has that transition been like? Yeah, uh, you know, it's a big change, but. Um, you know, the coaching staff has helped me get through this. Uh, the team has helped me get through this. And, um, you know, just really trying to immerse myself in, in the team and what the coaches are preaching every day. How what much you did think your was, comfort level go up as the game went on? Uh, you know, I felt more comfortable. You know, uh, you know, freshman coming in, you know, the first snap was always big for me. But, uh, you know, once I got that out of the way and started getting a little bit more completions under my belt, you know, the team started moving the ball, um, you know, I definitely felt more comfortable. Before you played this. How pass to Lewis develop from your perspective? Um, you know, he ran a great route. Uh, the offensive line held it up, and, you know, I did the easy part. I just put the ball up, so uh, he made a great catch on that. Hey, before you played this game, what was the biggest crowd you think you played in front of, like, or biggest venue? Uh, probably the Young Armour game, and I don't know how many that was, so I uh, definitely was his biggest day. Can you talk about how you felt pregame? Any nerves, or were you ready to go? Yeah, um, you know, definitely nervous. You know, the guys really helped me through that. Uh, and, you know, once once the game starts, you know, at the end of the day, it's just football. So How did that help you? What did they do to, to kind of get you a little calmer? Yeah, I mean, they had been there. So just telling me what it was like for them. And then, um, you know, at the end of the day, like I said, you know, after the first snap, it's football. So Chris, you should get the win in your first start. What does that mean to you? Yeah, you know, I mean, I think it was a great team win. I think it helps us, you know, moving on with the season. Um, you know, it's definitely what our goal was. We accomplished it, so we just got to continue to win each day. What, what, what was uh, Bill's demeanor like after he made the mistake on the interception? How is what's his personality like when you, when you make a mistake? Um, you know, I, I really didn't pay much attention. <laughs> you, you no, no, I mean like I did, but he really didn't say much. So, um, you know, he really gave. He understands that I understood what I did wrong, yeah. and uh, you know, I just tried to go out and correct it. Did you, you How did he understand that? On the, on the passing game in the second half. Sorry, sir. Were you surprised by the emphasis on the passing over the run in the second half? Um, you know, they're not. I'm not going to say either way. Uh, you know, he just had a lot of confidence in what we were doing as a team, and um, you know, we executed pretty well. What have these last three and a half weeks been like for you? Um, you know, it's been a big transition. You know, like like someone said earlier, you know, I was playing baseball, um, and you know, just coming in here and really trying to just immerse myself, like I said, just be, be what I can, you know, fill my potential. So. Do you think do things sometimes feel like they're kind of spinning out of control? Yeah, I mean, it's definitely, I'm not going to say they're spinning out of control, but, you know, it's definitely a big transition. Um, you know, but I got a lot of people around me, my parents who've been through it, um, you know, my family, coaches to rely on. So. Coach, can you talk about the job of the offensive line today? I saw you celebrating with some of those guys after the game. Yeah. How important is that? Yeah, they did a great job. You know, the, uh, Syracuse was a great team. They brought a lot of pressure, um, and it was relentless. It was all game. So our, our offensive line did a great job picking that up. What's it, the one time on the uh, the pass where you really stood in there and you had a blitz right in your face, it's the one that Robinson ended up fumbling, but it was a completed pass. Go through that pass, do you remember? Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, he ran a great route. Um, you know, 
I just, I, again, I think the easy part is literally the ball. Um, well, it wasn't that easy because that so. guy was coming right, right yeah. in your face. Yeah, I knew I was going to get hit, but at the end of the day, you know, that's that's part of the territory of being a quarterback. What's it like being